Oklahoma City's leading Cleveland by a score of 11 to 7. Smith's looking to set up in the paint. He loses control of it. Ball loose again. Two minutes remaining in the first quarter. Kicks it out to the corner. Driving baseline, closely guarded. He forces it, and a nice finish at the basket. He's averaging 11 points per game this season. You don't want to make a living taking contested two-point jump shots, but here it worked out because of superior concentration. To Irving. A powerful slam. A look at the athleticism exploding up to finish with the hammer. Durant against James. Cantor can't get it to go down. The NBA game is a long game. You may be down now, but if you string together three or four good possessions at both ends of the floor, you can be right back in it. To Irving. He's got two assists in this contest. Mozgov, ball is tipped, and they come up with it. To Ibaka. To the rim, unable to flip it in. James puts it up, hits for two. And LeBron James with eight points. When the game's in balance, you have got to create high percentage shots. They got this one here on a good catch and shoot play. Excellent anticipation to take the pass away. To James for two, Kyrie Irving with his fourth assist of the night. That's going to be a quick 20-second timeout. Jeff, the coach has some decisions to make right now. Hey, sometimes you just don't want to see your team for more than 20 seconds, and they don't want to see you. Let's be honest. You give them a quick point, and you want to go back to the bench because you're so tired of seeing the same guys night after night day after day, and they're sick of you, too. Substitutions, Oklahoma City. Augustine on the drive. Adams follows with the fourth shot. Nice finish around the rim. To James, he's averaging seven assists per game this season. So that'll end the first quarter. Oklahoma City's up by two. We'll have more Friday night NBA from ESPN after the break. Second quarter about to get underway. High scoring first period. Anybody gonna get any stops in this one? Yeah, this is like an all-star game with very good offensive players who are not committed defensively. It plays well in an all-star game, but you can't win consistently like this. To the rim, puts it in, plus the foul. LeBron James picks up his first of the night. That's big time play right there. Finishing the shot through the contact, and now goes to the free throw line. To the line, shooting one. Unable to connect on the free throw. Lots of room there. Won't go from outside the arc. That's solid offense. Getting their best players, their best shots, and their best spots. It didn't go in, but that's how you win games. Augustine on the drive. At the rim. Count it. And the foul. Mo Williams picks up his first foul of the night. Absorbs the contact, finishes the shot, and now works his way to the free throw line. And he can't convert the free throw. Gets the wide open look for three. Roberson the rebound. And Oklahoma City calls a timeout. Looks like it's going to be a full one.
Oklahoma City has made a few substitutions here. And he curls in to Durant. Passes out to the perimeter. Durant, the jumper. Can hit from three-point range. Augustine. Spins for the open look. Can't get it to go. That's good team defense right there, forcing that miss. James, the jumper. Waiters, the rebound. Waiters for two, lets it go. Knocks down the shot. Eight point lead for Oklahoma City. He got a hand in his face, but had no impact on the shot. Nice two point jumper. James has the double team close in. Durant the rebound. He's averaging six boards per game this season. Durant on the drive to the rim, gets it to go. Plus one, the block called against Verja. And Kevin Durant will go to the line looking to complete the three-point play. Terrific concentration to finish the shot and now shoot a free throw. Knocks down the free throw, and that completes the three-point play. And we're going to have a timeout. The Cavs down by 11. You can't allow teams in the NBA to go on extended runs. You've got to use your timeouts wisely. This was a good one. It's gone by in the second. The Thunder up by 11. Williams on the drive, hooks it up, and Mo Williams with a nice shot for two. That's just a nice layup right there. Augustine on the drive. To Shumpert. Nice ball movement. Loves working hard, trying to back down his opponent. Westbrook on the drive. Spins and fires. Puts it in, and they take this lead into double figures. He's the league's top scorer this season. Well, that's just beautiful offensive basketball. To shoot it and not even notice the guy who's contesting the shot. Love against Westbrook. Fires for three from the corner. Nails the jumper from downtown. Hey, you can only control what you can control. The defense there was great. It was just a better shot. Misses it, and the lead still in single figures. To Shumpert. Fakes the drive, but steps back. Waiters, the rebound. Waiters. Moves into the front court. Oklahoma City's leading Cleveland by a score of 26 to 18. And DJ Augustine with a two-pointer. That's a 13 to 5 run for the Thunder. To Verajal. Easily gets past him with the dribble. Steps back for the jumper. Jumper won't go. And that's a tough shot right there. Solid team defense forcing the miss. Pretty pass. Oklahoma City. David Glad switching a few players here. Shot swatted away, goes out of bounds, so it'll be Cavaliers' ball. Mozgov, and here's the double. 
misses. It's hard to pass the ball out of a great double team because you come to their body where they have no room to pivot or create space to throw the ball out of the low post. Yep, he hit a, a foul called against James. And Deion Waiters will go to the line with under 30 seconds to go here in the first half. Excellent offensive play right there. Contact, finish, just didn't get it to drop for the three-point play opportunity. Able to convert on both free throws. Down to a half minute remaining in the first half. The Thunder up by 12. To Love. Excellent ball movement. Great teamwork. Three point attempt. to the corner waiters from downtown in the corner love the rebound and that'll do it for the first half oklahoma city's up by 12. stay tuned for halftime we'll be back shortly after the break and we're back at the chesapeake energy arena for the second half which is just about underway along with jeff van gundy mike green on hand Oklahoma City's got to be very happy with that first half. Now they've got to have that killer instinct, Jeff. Yeah, exactly. And this is what few NBA teams have. Very few NBA teams and players can continue to keep up a great level of intensity and concentration when they're playing with a lead. Don't ask me why, but it is a problem league-wide. Westbrook bringing it up. To the rim, nicely, it's good, and one. He got there late, the foul call against Irving. And Russell Westbrook will go to the line for the first time tonight as he looks to complete the three-point play. Absorbs the contact, finishes the shot, and now works his way to the free throw line. To James, there's the perfect pick. Throws it down, what a play. Hey, the switch may be easy to start with, but then it just gets harder. You use your dribble, attack the mismatch, blow by him, and finish at the basket. Westbrook against Irving. Adams looking to operate from down low. Pass to the top of the key. To Waiters, Waiters fires from downtown with one on the 24. Too much time. There's a shot clock violation called against the Thunder. Ball's back in. Irving in possession. Ball knocked out of his hands. Reaches in for the steal. Stolen by Westbrook. To Ibaka. Quick release for three. Russell Westbrook with his third assist of the night. Mike, you hear me say this all the time. It's about passing on time and on target, and he's doing that here today. To the basket, flips it up. The Cavs with the offensive rebound to keep it alive. Westbrook on the drive for the layup. Knocks it down. And Russell Westbrook with seven points. And here's the replay with another look at that great finish at the rim. Sometimes the simplest plays are the hardest ones to execute. Good layup. 